Okay, standing lead leg side kick tutorial. Okay, we're going to start this either from a standard fighting stance or an L stance, depending on how you want to do. The execution, or the execution is pretty much the same. I'm going to do it from a fighting stance. From here, we're going to break this into several parts. Number one, shift your weight to your rear foot, draw the lead foot in. One more time. Draw it in. Number two, we're going to slide the foot up the leg so that it rests on the knee. Not too much, essentially just contouring the foot to the leg. Number three, we're going to pivot over. From here, my base heel should be pointed directly at the target. My hips are also pointed at the target. My shin and lower leg should be extended and form a straight line towards the target. From here, I'm going to extend the leg out striking the target, five is to bring it in, six to lower, and seven to slide back out. One more time, one, draw in, two, lift, three, pivot over, four, extend, five, draw in, six, lower, seven, back out. Done in fast motion. Just like so. Hand position will vary if you're talking about performing the execution traditionally. One hand will punch while the other hand is drawn to the hip. If it's more combat oriented, like a fight, I tend to keep my hands up like a boxer. That concludes lead leg side kick tutorial. Step behind side kick tutorial. Okay, this one I think is actually a little bit easier to learn than the standing side kick. Um, usually when I work with people, I usually teach this one first. Rather than starting in an L stance or fighting stance, we're actually going to start in a horse riding stance or a sitting stance. It's a little bit easier to learn from here. Okay, so hands can be up facing the target. Target will be over here. From here. Step one, we're going to take our rear leg and we're going to slide it in behind, pointing our heel at our target. As I do so, my hips are going to turn. From here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to shift my weight to that leg. And as I shift, I'm going to chamber this leg here. As I chamber, notice I begin to lean down and away for my target. Then from here, I extend the kick, strike in, retract, put it back down, and either slide out into my L stance, fighting stance, or horse riding stance. So one more time. Step one, step behind, point the heel to the target, let the hips turn naturally towards the target. Step two, shift weight. Step three, push off and chamber the leg. Step four, fire the kick. Step five, retract it. Step six, step down. Done in fast motion. Just like so. That concludes our step behind side kick tutorial.